Hello everyone and welcome to the Assassin Archer Guide. This is Mr. Radis and I will be walking you through the best uh, perks to get the and how to shoot pretty much headshots every time. Now first off is the archery tree, which is the most important tree for an archer. And that should be obvious enough. Now, first talent you get, overdraw. This is very this is the best thing you can get as an archer. You need to max this out as soon as possible. So if I get my archery up to forty before you say level 10 then I, I I'm going to go with this I'm not gonna go with anything else that's that's for sure next talent eagle eye is very very good as well but it, it it does it's not necessary you don't have to take it if you don't want to but some people do like it so I took it steady hand that's 50% pretty much for slow time that's very good too and if you like if you want to get the perfect shot this is pretty much necessary power shot not the best, but it is. It's good if you're uh, close combat, so you can just stagger them, but not really far, not long range. This is good if you use uh, anything above steel. I would say steel arrows, iron, iron arrows. I wouldn't go for it at all, just because they're they're so common. Able to move faster with the drawn bow. That's all right. It's not bad. It's just easier to travel. Really, it's not. It doesn't enhance combat in any way, but quick shot does. 30% faster draw bow, which isn't great, but it's handy, I guess, just like uh, Ranger. Bullseye isn't a very good talent, only only uh, at close range. I would never ever recommend it at long range, really, since you should be getting like three times uh, bow hit with deadly aim. Now, next tree is the sneak tree, which is is good as it contains deadly aim, but the other stuff is very useful too. Now, stealth, 25% harder to detect while sneaking, is very, very good, that's what I've got right now. Muffled movement isn't necessary, as light armor does very little, anyway. Um, sneak attacks with one-handed weapons, now do six times damage, very useful, very useful. Uh, deadly aim, of course, that's what you need. Uh, sneak attack with daggers, now do a total of 15 times normal damage, that, that can be very, very handy, if you're at a close range. Light foot, you won't trigger pl pressure plates. That's good, but it's not necessary. It's not like when you uh, you can't get an enemy to walk into a trap that way, so it's not as fun. Silent roll that can be useful, but it's really it, it it's not necessary at all. Silence. That's this is very good if you are trying to get some good shots in and you're close by close to enemies and you want to hurry up. And shadow warrior, pretty much get out of combat immediately just from crouching. So that's very useful. I definitely recommend that. Now, Archery and Sneak, they're the two main trees I would go for, but Illusion is also a strong one. I personally haven't gone in Illusion since I don't really need it as an Archer, but it can be useful to uh, go invisible, uh, muffle your footsteps, etc. And one-handed also, which is can be used, sorry, it's doing with one-handed, which can be useful as well. Some very nice stuff in there, if you can look at that. Now, today I'm going to show you how I execute the shots I do. Alright, so we have the target dummy over here. And just to be clear, I'm going to show you which one it is, which is this one. And I'm going to try and do a headshot from this distance. So now, it's at a side shot, so it's not going to be easy, but I'm going to teach you how to do it. Now, first thing you do, when you crouch down, you see uh, an eye. You can see an eye, and that's when you're being detected. But you can, you can do this even when, you, when you're hidden. So you look at the dot right in the middle of the eye, and you don't. You know, a lot of people do. What they do is they are, they focus it on the target they're trying to get. But that is not what you want to do. What you want to do is instead, is go slightly down until the eye, is on the edge. Like what your target is on the edge of the eye, and when you shoot, it should land there. Let's see how that went. Straight in the head. Perfect shot. Now this is what you're trying to aim for every time you do it. This is this is the the key to being a successful archer. And headshots aren't actually necessary, but they feel very good when you pull them off. Now, if you want to practice, this is the Thieves Guild in uh, Rifted, and any city pretty much has a target dummy you can go on. But best off, I think, is just go out into the world and find enemies and practice on them. Just save and keep practicing until you can uh, pull it off. You know, without doing anything, you, it's just natural for you. Second nature. 
that's pretty much all I can tell you really that's all I know so if you like the video please subscribe if you're a new, new viewer like it subscribe everything if you're a subscriber I can't thank you enough for what you've done for me over the past few weeks I've really built up the channel a bit and I'm very happy with how it turned out but if you have any questions please post them as a comment I will get right down to answering them as soon as I can and thanks a lot goodbye